think we, the first time that the, the river state government is organizing this without sponsors. And I hope there are no, I mean, without uh, consultants. And I hope there are actually no consultants. It, it's really um, our way of celebrating the creativity, the resilience, the, the, the vision of the rivers people. Um, if, if you look at it, you'll find out that River State was actually the, the base, had the base of, of the Nollywood industry. It's, it, the, its origins, its beginnings. Talk about the actors and actors Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well. Its beginnings were right there. And I think that what we're doing is in line with the vision of His Excellency the Governor of River State, returning the creative industries, because that's one industry that can employ people that is, you know, entrepreneurial in nature. It's also about the knowledge economy, but it's also using film, which is a strong medium, to tell our stories and to redefine our values. And this year, for instance, the theme is illegal bomb crew. It's a project that um, has come to encourage a lot of young filmmakers around here. And I want to commend the Ministry of Information and Communication for bringing all these artists here and organizing this film celebration. I think it's something good. And I tell you, there are lots and lots of talented people around here. This project will showcase them in time to come. It's like putting a camera in the hands of a young man to go into the streets and do something with it, you know. You can imagine what you're going to get, especially a young man who is very familiar with the streets, you know. So I think this is a good project. We're going to see you know, the, the rewards in the next uh, few years to come. Well, my interest is that it's an avenue to bring investment, investors of different nature to River State, which is for the, for the good of the, for the state, revenue wise and so on, and even employment. I think it's wonderful, it's a new innovation. I mean, I think it's something that is worth the military. Right now, I think what we need to do is to explore our economic uh, capacity. And uh, for me, the youth are very vibrant, available, and have the energy. And so whatever it is, you can do to channel their interest and keep them busy, and also help them to probably earn income and become de uh, dependent, I think uh, it's, it's welcomed. And this is why I'm like commending the Ministry of Information for the world, uh, job well done. All right. We're all partners in progress. In a similar development, the Joint Task Force combating illegal bunkery has busted a bunkery syndicate which siphons crude into vessels and barges for sale. Tune in to News Flash at 4 p.m. this evening. Well, my interest is that it's an avenue to bring investment, investors of different nature to River State, which is for the, for the good of the, for the state, it's very wise and so on, and even employment. It's a creative uh, adventure, and I want to believe that there are a lot of youth in River State who have that tendency to involve in creative arts, but they need a venue to express what Helen God has given to them. But having seen this one now, tomorrow you'll see more people wanting to them because they don't need to go out of River State to uh, be their uh, they have to do it okay. here in River State. Okay. So it's, an, uh, it's a good venture. All right, all right. Right now it might look like a little drop in the ocean, but when you look at the impact of film, you will find out that its effects are very far reaching. And we are very certain that the ripple effects will be way, way, way beyond what we can make.
for that state to the late what is going on there so that our talent, Nigerian talent, can play more in the international domain as it is important that talent are inspired and developed as a case may be. So for me, you know, the organization should do more work in order to ensure that this story succeeds the life of the day and continues to be respected and appreciated. Anybody who wants to make a difference can invest in it. If the man does not have a purpose to wake him up, it becomes interesting. So they should continue this agenda so that young people can be inspired and developed. Well, I think this is the beginning of uh, a very promising uh, venture here in River State. Um, the film industry is one of the fastest growing uh, areas of the economy in this country. And River State has what it takes to develop the film industry. Uh, we have the terrain, we have the talent, and I believe we have the money. So with men and material and beautiful topography, we can make a very good film environment. I believe the future is good. I'm happy, I'm happy this kind of thing has taken off. This has been, you know, my dream that we encourage our young men and women, very talented people around here. You know, give them a little leverage to showcase what they have inside. And I think this project has, you know, um, you know, has taken off in that direction. I, th I think it's a good thing. It's beautiful to see that um, the River State government is interested in developing the film industry in the state. What is of um, particular interest to me is the fact that um, it's more of an enlightenment film creation. Okay. It's not the kind of thing we see in Nollywood where we show the dirtiness, the filthiness of life. Okay. I mean, how corrupt Nigerians are and all that. This is more of an education. This is more, more of um, enlightenment. If we can keep up with that, it would be nice okay. to reform the society. Uh, well, the thing is that uh, we do films, we're into entertainment. Okay, so we're going to invest this money back into what we do, you know, so that we can reap more as well give back to the society. Are you, are you pleased with this job? Yes, yes, I'm very pleased with the judgment. I'm happy to actually be a winner of this competition and I'm very happy today. I'm proud to be a river person. And I hope I will that rivers and whole world will see the greater part of this. Thank you. Next time you are called Yes, but we're looking forward to winning international awards now because already we've won awards within our own. So we're going forward to the whole world award. Well, it is a creative of my adventure, and I want to believe that there are a lot of youth in River State who have that tendency to involve the creative arts, but they need a venue to express what talent God has given to them. But having seen this one now, tomorrow you will see more people wanting to them because they need to go out of River State. They need their uh, talent. They have to be here in River State. So it's a uh, good venture. It's uh, motivating. It's uh, in the right direction, especially for the young ones who uh, are looking for new avenues of survival. Because we have always thought that life is just one way, but this, this should be uh, provocative. Should provoke them yep. to better busy. think, yep. get busy, get compete, busy. compete with yep. other people anywhere else in the world. Right. So every year we'll have the Ruby Pro Awards, and uh, we will deal with issues that are of interest to our people. We will encourage our young people. I think this is just the beginning.